My name is Mary Calvert and I'm a photojournalist. Before I began my freelance career a year and a half ago, I was a photographer on the staff of the Washington Times for 11 years. My main body of work in Washington is covering Capitol Hill and the White House and big news events in D.C. But my true calling is covering human rights issues, women and children in crisis around the world. When I teach students, one of the most important things, if not the most important thing after learning your camera and understanding basics of composition and all that is taking moment pictures. And moment pictures are pictures that have a person doing something in them. Whether it's um, an expression, whether it's two people together, a person reacting to their environment or to another person, it's something that sets that picture apart from just a plain picture that's just got information in it. And it's one of the hardest pictures to make, and that's why it's so important. Because if you bring back good moment pictures, they will end up being the cornerstone of every photo album, every family event, and every assignment that you ever shoot for the rest of your life. I started out as a fine art photographer. And when I was in school, I also dabbled in other majors like travel and tourism and mental health and liberal arts and fine art photography and studio photography. And finally, I realized that photojournalism was the best parts of all those different majors all rolled into one. And it's allowed me to travel the world and to meet people. And over the years, I've followed in the footsteps of war to places like Afghanistan and Pakistan and Congo. And always, it was the women and children that, that caught my eye as they were peering out of doorways and through the veils of oppression. And that's just led me to my, to my calling to tell the stories of those who have no voice.